Hello and welcome back once again to Rob's Homemade Food and Recipes and today I'm going to be doing my first hot sauce review from the World Traveller's Hot Sauce Xmas gift that was given to me. So we're going to start with the Egyptian Fire Scarab Sauce which by the name of it I'm assuming it comes from Egypt sorry. Uh, product of China so it's obviously made in China there's no ingredients on the actual bottle all the ingredients are on the box that the individual bottles come in and I haven't read the ingredients on the back so I'm going to try and use my taste buds to work out what is actually in this hot sauce consistency quite liquidy thin you can see the red chilli flakes in there so I'm assuming they've used red chillies there's some dashes of green in there could be a herb or a spice so we'll get this open and actually see what's in there so get this bad boy open I know a lot of people out there are hoping one of these sauces will actually blow my head off one of these days so we'll have to wait and see what actually happens whether it does blow me away or not so we're having a bit of trouble getting in but there we go definitely a red chilli vinegar citrusy smell definitely lemon or lime I'd say more lemon than lime and there's definitely some herb in there. I'm not quite sure on the smell what it is, but let's have a blast at the Egyptian fire scarab sauce. So, teaspoon, decent sized teaspoon full. We'll have a quick look. Core really see it's like a jelly type consistency, quite thin, but it's a little bit of a uh, heat. Still can't wait. It's definitely lemon juice vinegar, chilies, there's a, something in there, I'm not quite sure, let's see if I can get it with a taste. The initial kick, quite spicy, quite uh, instantly hits the back of your throat, a nice taste, the acidity and the lemon make it nice. And it's, I think it's rosemary, I'm not 100% sure, but I would have to check the back of the box to um, go for definite, but I'm pretty sure it's got that rosemary taste, but not a bad at all. In the packet, <coughs> plain simple label, Egyptian fire scarab sauce, 48 millilitres, not bad at all, not bad. So, probably give that seven maybe tasty I like the lemon taste and I'm, I'm, the rosemary taste does linger in your mouth it's, it's a nice I do like rosemary especially when you have it on your lamb and stuff like that but yeah not bad at all so this is the first hot sauce of 15 out of the world travelers pack that I've got and I will be doing the rest over the next couple of months hope you like this video I'm not sure where you can get this Egyptian sauce from, you'd probably have to search the web for it or I could find out where I got the Traveller's Pack from of the person who gave it to me but not a bad start to the first ones, not a bad start at all so I hope you like my video please 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 smash that like button it means more than you know um, also hit that subscribe button if you're watching me for the first time thank you very much for popping over and watching Rob's homemade food recipes and reviews so fingers crossed another hot sauce review soon I've got loads of ideas like I said in my Christmas video for stuff for the new year a couple of challenges and um, my peanuts and chocolates some coming so they'll be all done very soon so thank you very much for watching hope you enjoyed this Egyptian fire scarab sauce review not a bad little sauce I'd recommend it for most people not a massive chili thing the initial heat's there but apart from that the rosemary taste and lemon juice adds a nice flavor to it 
So thank you very much for watching and goodbye.